Hello, everybody. Give me one second. Hello, hello, Rain and Bran and T and Snackers. How's it going? How's it going, everybody? Just pulling up my pattern. I love your toe, Wolverine. How's it going today? Happy time zones. Okay, got my pattern up. Oh, thank you, T. I'm so happy to be back. Honestly, it's been a really, like, really exhausting um, past, like, week or so, but it's starting to calm down, and I'm excited for it. How are you? I'm super good, Snackers. Thank you for asking. Let's move over to crafting, and we'll just jump right into it today. Here we go. Is everything good? No, it's not good. I never cleared the daily goals. <laughs> Give me one second, I'll get that worked out. Do, 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 do. Whoop. There it is. Hello, Nathan, how's it going? How's it going, how's it going? Give me one second to get this restarted. Do, do. Did that fix it? It should fix it. It might not though, we'll see. I've missed you guys so much. House, yes, yeah, so tomorrow we get to go look at the house again that we're really interested in. And then the day after tomorrow, this, we should be able to apply, name? should. You guys are so sweet. Did it fix? No, I it didn't. For 30, for 30 minutes. minutes. You can handle it from here. Do do. So exciting! I can't wait. Hello, hello, Nathan. How's it going? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. We did just do it. Um, a couple days ago. Where you come from? Anyone can cook. Can be great. Thank you, Nick. You're so sweet. I should really wait 30 minutes, then talk? Why? Oh my gosh. The entrance. That would be fucking hilarious. I love that, Amanda. Sorry, give me one second. I forgot about my daily goal thing, so I did not set it before I came in today. And now I don't know if it's going to reset. It did. Yay. Okay, cool. I will next time play in the long game, Amanda. Nick, thank you so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You guys are all so sweet. How are we doing today? Uh, I'm glad I'm back to somewhat normal with stream. Uh, but I know you have been sick and the whole ordeal with moving. Yes, I'm glad it's getting back to normal too. It might not stay normal for very long, depending on how Wednesday goes. If we end up getting to apply and then um, we get approved, I'll probably be like in and out from schedule for a while. Potatoes. Ta -da! Stick them in a stew. Hi, peeps. I'm getting ready to run errands, but wanted to say you're all great, and I hope you have an amazing day. I hope you have an amazing day. Be safe on your errands, okay? Be safe, be safe, be safe. Also, if my, if my audio is weird at all, I had to mess with it the other day, and now I'm not sure if it's too loud or too quiet. It feels pretty good, though. Spotify might be a little loud, but everything else feels good. <laughs> We all have bird brains sometimes. It's just one of those, it's just one of those lifes, you know? <laughs> um, that would be so funny. <laughs> I love it. Thank you. Thank you. So the headphones are, um, pretty basic. I got them on Amazon. I uh, keep getting ear infections and I think it's because I stream so much with these in-ear headphones ears angry. So I said, you know what? We'll get over the ear headphones and 
this morning I crocheted these little loops to go around them so that I could put my clips that I always wear in my hair like like the bat wings or the little devil ones. I was like I need to still be able to utilize these even with headphones. So I just crocheted like little little loops around to attach them to. Yeah. I can't stay long because there's a lot going on in the Grove House community space. I've got two, I gotta move two giant fridges and set up food stuff and all sorts of things. Heck yeah! Well, I hope you have a good day doing all of that. Please stay safe out on all, all the adventures. You've been getting so much done um, lately with that. Exactly, you're killing it! You're killing it! Okay. We'll go ahead and we'll get this started. I was working on this yesterday and <laughs> it's so big now, it takes so long on every round that we're working on. And I was doing the wrong stitch for like an entire round yesterday. I felt so defeated. I was like, you know what? I think I need a nice little breaky break from this project. So I set it down. I know, it was wild. I was so angry, so angry. <laughs> Uh, I'm gonna need some Trinket Sorcerer's headphone accessories. Yes, I was. I've been like searching their page for like forever now, um, and I'm so ready. I was looking at it the other day. I was like, when I have money, it's happening. We're gonna have so many cool headphone accessories, uh, and I also want to look into crocheting more too, because this was there's a there's a very easy way to get some cool stuff in, you know. Wrap around, wrap around. I love you, Snaggers. Uh, my new job starts in eight days. Oh my gosh. Eight days. Are you excited, Nick? Are you just absolutely uh, exploding at the anticipation of of your new job? Oh my gosh, yes. Bug antennae. Amazing. Amazing. You can make little mushrooms. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Like little mushrooms. I'm sure I could figure out. I know that there's a couple of patterns out there for like elf ears or, you know, whatevs. All the cool stuff. Oh, I forgot to start my timer. The fact that I'm so far into this project and like hour wise and I still have so much to go. I feel like I hit a wall with every project that I work on where if it takes me 10 hours or more, once I hit the 10 hour mark, I'm just officially fucking over it. <laughs> Following a person who's doing a pattern for a mushroom scene headband. Ooh. Oh, that's cool. They're in the testing phase. I absolutely, hands down to anyone who can write patterns. I My brain does not function on that level. Um, it always blows my mind. It takes so much time and effort too. Like they really, they're really working hard. Eat some food, you silly goose. You gotta eat, Nathan. You gotta eat. I stay well fed. Um, yeah, it was a lot. It was crazy. Aw, Nick! You got us started. Nothing popped off, but I'm guessing you subbied. I'm guessing. Maybe in a second it'll it'll hit or something. Thank you though, Nick. Thank you, thank you. I might, depending on what it looks like when I get done with this uh, set of repeating stitches, I might call it for it. I know it's supposed to be like pretty dang long, but it doesn't have to be that long, right? Maybe stop like right here. It'll be a cropped poncho. <laughs> Uh, boop a doop a doop a doop. There we go. Yes, yes, I'm excited. 
I think that'll that'll work fine. We'll see. We'll see how it goes. There it goes. Seven fucking months. That's wild. That's wild. Thank you so much for the subby. Oh my goodness. Seven whole months. That's crazy. We're only like ten months into streaming, right? Right? Maybe not. Maybe nine? No, 10. It has been 10. For some reason, I got disconnected from chat and had to... Yeah, uh, that's been happening to me a lot lately, even on desktop. If it's cropped enough, you can find a way to wear bat wings under it. Oh my gosh, yes. My goodness. Twitch be twitching all the time. Mobile is such an experience. <laughs> Oh, uh, yes, I got to pick the colors. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They, uh, they didn't mind. Whatever colors you did, as long as you followed the pattern. I think the one that I initially saw that they made, it's black. Or no, it was red with black lines, like with the black webbing. And then I saw them make another one that was black with white webbing. Um, yeah, I was like, I want it to be pink because I'm keeping this one. This is mine. Mine. I'm excited. Uh, the thought of moving into a new house and having like closet space to actually be able to like crochet and keep stuff for myself. I'm super excited. I'm super, super excited. Ooh, a patchwork card, e rain How long have you been working on that? Do, 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 do. Lasagna! Hello! How's it going? How are you doing today? Yes! Yeah, I'm excited. I've been on um, Pinterest. I've been like re-obsessed with Pinterest all over again. I'll, to, to be fair though, I don't think I was ever actually obsessed with Pinterest before. Um, but I finally like opened it back up and like made an account and and tried to get into it and now i'm obsessed i've been sucked in there's so many crochet patterns and recipes and everything is so fucking aesthetic <laughs> i wanted to ask something did you lose your sense of smell or taste with covid because when i got covid i lost it for like three months and my cousin got it two years ago and she still hasn't gotten her senses back okay so i've had covid a total of two confirmed times maybe three there at the beginning before COVID tests were like extremely accessible. Um, the first time I had no issue like that or like the first time, uh, I don't really know if I had COVID that time, but I was very, very sick. Um, no issue that time. The second time I got it, I as well lost taste and smell for like three months. This last time I didn't lose it at all. Uh, which is just wild to me. I was so scared when I first tested positive. I was like, well, there it goes. I'm not gonna be able to taste or smell anything again for months. And it didn't happen. But this is a different variant than uh, the one that was moving around back then with the one that stole all my taste. So I don't know if that has something to do with it. I'm over here with crochet and iron beads. I love it. Pinterest has become my obsession. It's where I live now. 28 squares into at least 85, uh, but I may make it larger. Okay, that's dope. And you just got started and you already have 28 squares? How big are the squares? You kicking ass. Kicking ass. It's going nice, how are you? I'm doing super good, lasagna. I'm super excited to be back, hanging out with everybody, getting some crocheting done. Um. Yee. Everything is just, the energy and anticipation is so high in this house right now because of all the moving news that's going to be coming up within the next week. Um, oh. I feel like I'm off energy-wise at all times. Like I'm either like all the way up here, like super excited, rattling on and on and on and on, or I'm like all the way down here and I've used all my energy on moving thoughts and <laughs> I'm just like blank blank in the brain 
Uh, I asked because I've saved a jar of peach jam for you, but I haven't had the money to send it over yet. Oh yeah, no worries. It would be better to send it for friends. Ooh, that would be cute. I would love that. Cause then for Friendsgiving, I could make an apple pie. I would love that. That would be amazing. You lost it for like two days. It was not bad at all. That's wild. That's wild. First confirmed time, the second confirmed time I didn't. That is so weird. So weird. Cool Ranch Doritos taste like original sunflower seeds to me now. What? That's wild. Soft smells like lavender. I have to dig my nose into it. Whoa. That's insane. I've had it once and I have asthma. My initial thought was, well, it was a good run. <laughs> Thankfully, I was fine by the end of the week. Good, 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 good. I'm glad you recovered within a week. I know some people get long COVID and I couldn't imagine. I couldn't imagine being that sick for that long. I, I feel so bad for them. Uh, there are 15 stitches by 15 rows, except for the one type of yarn I had to do 17 by 17 to keep the sizing. Gotcha. It's all single crochet, so it's really easy to zone out. Nice. Oh, I really love that. Super easy peasy. It's homemade from this year's peach harvest in my dad's backyard. That is so amazing. I would like, I would be honored to try, Nick. I would be honored to have a, a jar sent over to me. I'd have to do something real fancy too, like some super fancy apple pie. <laughs> Um, I went three years without giving COVID and then my three year streak ended. I didn't lose my senses of taste or smell. Just a really bad sore throat. Good. Oh, I'm glad you didn't lose anything. And it was just a sore throat. That's, that's the good side of it. But I am sorry that you lost your, uh, three year streak. <laughs> that's terrible. I went this far and got it last year during summer. It took two and a half days to recover and props. Yeah. Props to anyone who, who manages through long COVID. That's just wild to me. Sab, hello, how's it going? How are you doing? How you doing? How you doing? I saw you, you pop in yesterday. Yesterday was so chaotic, so I'm so sorry if I missed any messages. It's always, always during Kathy streams, I can't keep up with the messages, uh, just cause I'm really like focusing in on the lesson and what we're doing, you know? But I appreciate all of you being there. Um, you so sweet. I chug a thing of Sunny D, I think that helped. Oh, possibly, possibly. Yeah, how have you been, Seb? How's it been going? I know I haven't been around for a minute. Yeah, super focus mode. I really, really liked working on Unity though. Like, don't get me wrong. I also liked what we were doing in C Sharp. Um, but if there's one thing I'm not, it's a writer. <laughs> I am not a writer. I want to make video games, not to make my own video games, <laughs> but to make other people's ideas and, and dreams and stories. I want to make those come true, you know? I'm not a writer. It's not happening. Yeah, I had, I had to steal the brain cell from you guys. I couldn't give it away for free yesterday, you know? I needed it. <laughs> Cool Ranch Doritos was my favorite too. And I was like, mm, I haven't had them in a while. So I got them. Oh no. Wait, does it still taste like that Snackers? Is your taste still, you said that, right? Your taste is still messed. Been okay, kind of stressed, but working on it. I'm so sorry you're feeling stressed. If you ever need to like vent or just chit chat with us about what's going on or even just one-on-one, -on -one, um, chat is always open. Discord's always open. My DMs are always open. Anywhere you feel like landing, we got you. Cool Ranch is the goat. It is, though. It's the best one. Mmm, I don't know. The sweet chili ones are really good. Those, I think, are maybe my favorite. Um, the purple bag Doritos. Long COVID isn't fun. I still have issues with regulating my body temp and a host of other issues that have been popping up. It's basically medical whack-a-mole, honestly. Honestly. Ooh, what did you eat? Sweet chili is the best. It's just so good. They're hard to find though. They're hard to find. Mustard is goat as well. Wait, are there mustard Doritos? Thanks, I appreciate it. Honestly, it's just health anxiety and trying to work a ton to save up for surgery. 
Um, but I've been doing better. I'm glad you're doing better. <sighs> Health anxiety. I feel that so much. <laughs> um, but we got you. We got you. If you ever need to talk, purple bag is the best. It's just, it's the perfect amount of like spicy but sweet. You know? You know? You're planning, right, Sev? You're planning for top surgery, correct? I could be could be way off base here. Uh, health anxiety is so real. It is, it is, it is, it is, honestly. That's one thing I feel like I immediately connect with and understand. <laughs> I like to do the thing where I like suddenly notice a feeling in my body that's probably happened before. Um, but I just suddenly pay attention to it and then I overthink it for like a really long time. Ugh. That's been me lately. I don't know. There's like this weird feeling in my left arm and I don't know. I'm overthinking it, but it's probably always been there. I've been trying to find a good doctor in my area that specializes in trans health care and I found a good one, but my appointment is until November 20th. Oh my gosh, the appoint the the time is gonna fly. Let me just tell you, Sev. I know that it feels like it's gonna be a minute, but it's gonna fly by. You got this. Number 15. Hopefully, I can schedule something for early next year. That is gonna be so exciting. Will you let any of us know if you need anything? Again, even if it's just like venting and emotional support. Um, you know this. We we got you. We love you so much. I was about to say, I was literally just going to bring it up and then Nick pops up in chat. Nick's partner just went through this. Um, so if you have any questions, Nick will probably have a decent idea of like the secondhand knowledge. I'm not sure if Ollie would be comfortable being reached out to, but if he is, there is that. Absolutely, Seb. Oh my gosh. I'm just so happy for you. It's it's always good to hear when you hear a win like that, being able to find uh, a doctor that specializes in trans healthcare and stuff. That is just, it's like the breath of fresh air, you know? Like, I know that's not like the hardest part, but one of the hard parts is done. And that feels I'm so good. Trinky, hello, box. how's so it going? Sleep inside a log. I, I can't wear just what I wanna wear. I want to do the fog. Cause I'm, I'm not, not a person, person I'm, I'm a tiny little, little frog. frog. Ribbit. How's it going? How's it going? How's it going? Do, 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 do. I would pay for the surgery 10 times over if it meant Ollie got to feel this way. I love that so much. Making the call was the hardest part. Now I've gotten it over with. It's such a win. You're killing it. You're killing it, Sev. That is one of the hardest parts is just getting yourself to make that phone call and you fucking did it. You've got this. You got this. That is okay, Trinky. Let's all struggle with existence together. It's okay. We all struggle just a little bit. Um, but if you need anything, let us know, Trinky. Let us know, let us know. Also, I don't know what you were commenting on or what was pretty, but thank you. Thank you so much. Phone anxiety and medical anxiety. Ugh, oh, the worst, honestly. Do, do, do. Do. Oh yay! So sweet, Nick. Thank you, thank you, Ollie. That means so much. Uh, still, it's messed. Oh gosh, like tamales taste like they're expired, like sour. What? Cool ranch already now. Spicy, I have to have it extra spicy. What the heck? That's insane. And you said you got it last year during summer, right, Snacker? So it's been over a year and your taste is still messed up. That's wild to me. Yes. Um, chop the heck out of them Timkins. What are you making? We are making. Your new fur. Oh, 
my hair thank you <laughs> thank you thank you i uh, once once i started feeling a little bit better from the covid symptoms i was like you know what i feel like such butt like just mentally emotionally at that point it still felt like we were so far away from all the house news that we're super close to now um so i was like you know what we have black hair dye <laughs> Let me just finally do it. <laughs> but thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, I've had it like three times since then for sure. Twice. Oh. Oh, so that was the first time you got it. The last time was like February, March of this year. Oh, shit. That is wild. Yeah, house stuff is going okay. Um, we've kind of been waiting for a hot minute now. Um... Right now, what we're waiting on is uh, Michael LG <laughs> has signed a um, a paper for a retention bonus. So he has to stay working where he's working for a whole year, um, but they're gonna pay him like a little a little chunk sum bonus. Um, we've been waiting to see if that's gonna hit. They said that it would hit in the next one or two checks, but if it does, that's that's like the rest of what we need to move to to like make the applications pay for first and last month's rent all the pet fees all the deposits all that good stuff um so we were like fingies crossed for the longest time it was going to happen the last paycheck so like two weeks ago um but it didn't so we were just panicked for this past two weeks that that specific house was going to get rented and taken off of the market um, it isn't though, like it is still there. And the day after tomorrow, hopefully he will get that retention bonus and we'll be able to put in the application on Wednesday, hopefully. Um, and it'll be a good time. It'll be a good time. I'm, I'm staying super positive. Um, I think, I think this is meant for us. Like I'm not always very confident in a lot of things in life, but something about this just feels right, you know? Just feels right. <laughs> Not making anything, just cutting the tendons out of the chicken. So I, oh, nice. Oh, so it can last longer? Nice, oh heck yeah. House will happen, exactly. Exactly, exactly. Yeah, so nothing crazy yet. I'll definitely know Tomorrow we're gonna go to the house and we're gonna we're just like doing a second viewing um, And we're gonna like run all the water in the house uh, To make sure that there's no oh, issues yeah, with any I'm pipes And a knucklehead mixed spazitron Go away I'm 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 a goofy do gooper Goobs how's it going? No rainbow hair, who dis? <laughs> I know, it's gone, Gooey. It's gone. Um, honestly, I loved the rainbow hair. The effort that went into it, though. Uh, it is so much work. It was so much work. How have you been doing, Goobs? It's been a minute since I've been able to be on. I've missed you. I went to the state fair yesterday. Ooh, that sounds like so much fun, Trinky. Um, probably not for a really, really long time. Um, the issue with doing stuff like that to my hair was bleaching it. Sadly. Um, my hair's fried. <laughs> like, it's dead. And I'd really love to get back to my natural hair, like, texture. Um, so I probably won't be bleaching it ever again. I probably won't be doing any dyed colors in my hair but but can you see the little piece of color that's in here probably not it was gray it was gray i have tape in like a couple like tape in extensions up here um it was gray but when i washed my hair it took the water the like the the colored water from washing my black hair and it stained the gray and now they're dark blue yay um so in the future i plan to do like colors um but via like extensions 
I don't want to bleach my hair ever again. Uh, you know what happens when twice as many dad jokes are told? They double in size. Oh my gosh, Gooby. Oh my gosh. I love it. <laughs> my goodness. They double in size. The truth, though. The truth. But yeah, as much as I'll miss the colored, uh, the colored hair, I am very much looking forward to having some healthy, some healthy hairs. My hair is normally like super wavy and, ugh, I miss it. I miss when it wasn't completely fried all to shit. Do, 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 do. Yeah, I also, I was going to say that too. I really, really like how the black hair looks on me. I think just all of my features look nicer, you know? Hello, Dagon. How's it going? How's it going? How's it going? It looks amazing. Thank you so much. I am, I'm super, super liking it. I feel like my eyes are brighter and like my skin looks less pasty and it's really nice. I'm really enjoying it. But I definitely want to do like fun extension colors in the future. I was debating maybe having like a redeem go up every once in a while where someone can pick like some of the colors that go in my next like streak of extensions. My natural hair color is dark brown. It is it is a dark, dark brown. It's like a dark red brown too. Um, but yeah, 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 yeah. Rocks back and forth waiting for hair to grow. Pran is like, hurry the fuck up! <laughs> oh my goodness. Thank you, lasagna. Thank you. You're so sweet. You're so sweet. That's my plan too. Allergies prevent me from doing fun things. Extension life for me. Absolutely. Yeah, and it's always, um, you know, it's always hard to find. I hate clip-in extensions. Um, that's my big no-no. So I always thought extensions, like, wasn't gonna be something I'd want to do. Um, but the tape-in ones have been really nice lately. I don't mind them. I can't wait until I have more hair on, like, the sides and back of my head again. Um, because where the extensions are at, kind of, like, at the top of my head, um, they don't pull back very nicely, like, in a ponytail. They can, but it takes some effort take some effort yeah healthy hair thank you the neon bat ears with your black fur oh yeah that'll look so nice that'll look so nice i uh i was super excited i wanted to wear my clips today but i was like oh i have my headphones on uh those will clash like they'll fight with the clips so i just crocheted little bands to clip my hair clips on I can put my bat wings on there. I can put everything on there. Super excited. Um, the one that's that's one of the reasons I keep my hair black. I need to redo it as my hair is so much longer now. Heck yeah, heck yeah, heck yeah. Do 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 do. I had nice brown hair as well. Did you dye it? Did you dye your, do you did do you dye your hair, Wolverine? I was about to say, because the pictures I've seen of you, your hair color just looks so natural. Oh, what am I working on? I am pattern testing. Give me one second. I am pattern testing this pattern for a very sweet friend, mutual I have on TikTok. It is a spider web poncho. Woo. It's going to have a big ol' like neck cowl that like folds over kind of like turtleneck-ish um but like big if that makes sense um and so you'll go back in at the end and like surface crochet stitching up on each corner so it'll look like a little web by the end of it oh <laughs> I had hair then got married and lost it all oh no jeez Thinking about growing my hair out remembers the awful stem of having hair. Feels the need to shave head immediately. Yeah, hair is just not not meant for everybody, you know? Too many sensory issues can come with it. I'm like, 
I think back. See, I don't have an issue with my hair when it gets long to a degree. When it gets long enough that it's touching the back of my arms. Ugh, panic. <laughs> you know? <laughs> Absolute panic. <laughs> but I miss having hair. I miss being able to do pretty things with it. Like buns and... Thank you, Dagon. Thank you, thank you. I'm super excited about the pattern. I'm, I was... Honestly, honestly, over the moon when I found out that they had chose me for the pattern testing. I've done a lot of pattern testing for them in the past, so I was like, I have a chance. Um, but I also got in requesting it like the day before they picked all the testers, so I thought I was late. When my hair touches my face or neck, I literally get nauseous. Yes, oh my gosh, that makes so much sense. Keeping it short. I know, little space buns. Little space buns. My only other thing that I, I keep thinking about with my hair is, um, there's so much of it. <laughs> there's a reason I shave the sides in the back of my head. It's because I have way too much hair, just in general. It's so thick. There's too much of it. Um, so I think about that and I'm a little concerned. I might not grow my sides and my back out depending on how I feel once I start doing it. We'll see. <laughs> yes. Yeah, it just isn't worth it. That's very fair, Trinky. That's very fair. Do, 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 do. So hyped for Halloween. I am too. I'm trying to plan out a Halloween event for mainly through Discord. Um with different things like games. I want to do a costume contest. Um, just a lot of fun, cute stuff, you know. If you have any ideas, feel free to DM me or brand so that we can note it down. Ooh, a tiefling! I love that. I love that. I love that. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Do it slow. <laughs> One of the main reasons I want to grow my hair out, there are times where I have to pull it up because it's just too much. I also need to learn how to take care of wavy hair. Same! That's my big thing, is I gotta learn how to take care of it better. I think that that was a huge issue with when I used to have my hair very long, is I was like, working a full-time job, I was pregnant at the time. I just wasn't taking care of my hair properly. Um, so it would just become matted so fast because there was so much of it. Um, that that was initially the reason why I was like, shave it, shave it off, get rid of it. <laughs> Babbit, hello. Very true, thank you. Very true. Uh, you got the kids' costumes? Heck yeah, Amanda. What's everyone going as? How's it going today, Babbit? How's it going? I'm so happy it's pumpkin, <laughs> pumpkin spoopy season. I know. No, seriously. The second this time starts to hit, I'm like, yes. Yes. Uh, the eldest is going as Dorothy from The Wizard of Oz, and the twins are going to be Rockford Peaches from A League of Their Own. Ooh, I don't think I've seen that. Heck yeah, though. Excite. Halloween costumes are always the best time of the year. I don't know what I'm going to be able to throw together for a Halloween costume this year. We shall see. We shall see. Just got home after getting Chibi to the doctor in school. Almost got drenched right as I got to the door. Uh, if I hadn't had an umbrella. Oh gosh, I'm glad you did. So hard not to buy all the things. It's such a struggle. It is. I had a couple of ideas, but knowing that we're moving soon, like money's gonna be a little tight. I might just be a bat again. Uh, Cause it's easy and I have everything to do it. But I really wanted, when I when I did a bat next, I wanted to do it, like, right. 
do it like really, really cool. Um, but I don't think that's gonna be the case this year. A League of Their Own is one of my favorites. Oh, really? Really, really. But heck yeah, getting done with chibi stuff. Getting home, getting chillin'. Fatty Farron for the win. Oh, that would be cute if I could do like a pink version of it. I wanna be a dinosaur, but I don't like any other costumes. Aw, boo. Have you thought about trying to like make your own? You need to tell y'all that I've been asking for bat boxes in my neighborhood and we are finally getting going to get two? <gasps> That's amazing! T, I love that. I love that. Strategically place what buildings you put them on because once you put them on a building, uh, it's illegal for them to tear down the building. <laughs> Just a heads up. <laughs> Just in case you wanted to bar some people from some things. <laughs> Can't decide if I want to crochet a vault suit or just buy one because effort. Oh my gosh, I feel that so much. I feel that. Every time I think about something, I'm like, well, I could crochet that. There's a little piece in my head that's like, but you won't. <laughs> you could. You own the skill set, but you're probably not going to do it. So just accept that. Oh my goodness. Everything slash one I want to be for Halloween is so niche and I have to explain them to everyone and I don't know if I want to do that. Honestly, I love that though. I love that though. My Because my favorite part of that idea, right, is yeah, you'll have to explain it to a lot of people, but like, fuck them, right? Or you could, you could like show up with a bunch of cards that say exactly what you are and just start like handing it to people and walking away. But what, what I like about it, right? What, my, what I like about that idea is the people that get it, they're gonna get it. They're gonna tell you and you're gonna find your people, you know? I always think being something niche is a good idea. Since we'll be staying in, I'll probably wear one of my many ear sets. I love that. Yeet a card like a boomerang. Yeah, exactly. Do, do, do. Whoa, okay. Can they be put onto poles? I live in a historical neighborhood, so we aren't supposed to pull buildings down anyway, which works with. Oh, dope. That's amazing. I think they can work on poles. I think they can. I, I definitely look into it, um, but I think I've seen a few people put bat boxes up on poles. Uh, yeah, even if literally no one gets it, there's still the chance, you know? You could find it. What do you... Uh, you have a couple of ideas, though. I was about to say, it'll all probably go right over my head, but I'd still like to know. <laughs> Dude, I don't have the brains to make my own. That's so fair. That's so fair. I was going to... Okay, so for a little bit of, a little bit of backstory, Wolverine right now is writing a D&D &D campaign. Um, and they have contacted me to tell me about things in this D&D &D campaign because one of the villages is named after me. More so than that, one of the deities is named after me. And they are uh, the, the deity of uh, crafts and the moon. And now I just want to be that for Halloween. <laughs> I want to somehow make myself... Look like a deity of crafts and the moon simultaneously. Bam, bam, bam. Thank you for the hydrate dragon. Thank you, thank you. I don't know if you remember when I went through a quilting phase, but I've started looking at more quilting stuff online and thinking, yeah, I could do that. I do remember that. I've honestly, ever since you mentioned it, I've been super pumped for the day that we just get like, dropped an image of Nick's first quilt. I'm gonna be so honest, I haven't really stopped thinking about it. I wanna see, I wanna see your first quilt and I wanna be giddy about it and I wanna tell you how proud I am and I love that idea, Nick. Probably, probably rain, but you describe it to me. <laughs> I have probably seen it. Um, but I can't think of it off the top of my head. I can't think of it. 
One of my favorite uh, has a character named Vegas, and I think I could pull it off, but he's a human, and no one would probably know who he was just based off of an outfit, and also not knowing about Ty BLs. I think people on the internet would know it, but not anyone IRL. Yeah, that's very fair. I'll update their picture so they have black hair. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, <laughs> I was wondering if you were going to catch on, Wolverine, when I sent you the AI photo of the one with black hair. I was wondering if you were going to catch on that I had dyed my hair. Um, Kin Porsche, then I love you, even though the show is a mess. I've never seen it. I don't know anything. Ooh, uh, let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yes, yes, I did. I did see that. I saw that and I want it very badly. Very, very badly. I don't know if I've ever mentioned this to anybody here from the stream, but the first time I saw something and I was like, I need to learn how to crochet, it was the Twisted Hatter and it was, it was like they had a Sam, what would you call it? Like bodysuit? It was like shorts and, um, it was like a little onesie, right? But like a little shorts onesie. That was the moment. I was like, I need to learn how to crochet because I literally have Sam tattooed on my arm. Romper thing, yeah. I guess that's a, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Um, one second, I'm gonna pause my timer and catch up on chat. Uh, I will never forget this. One Halloween I was walking around with my fam and I saw this little boy from Attack on Titans. Apparently, I was the only one who noticed. His mom stopped me and said he is shy, but you made his day. I love that. Cappy, hello. Welcome in, Cappy. How you doing? How you doing? Oh, Cappy, I've been meaning to message you, but I literally forget all the time. I need you to pick out what you would like your entrance command to be. We have it so it gives you a shout out every time you come in. But I mean like animation on the screen. You know, audio, animation, whatever, whatever you want. Uh, I usually keep them about 15, 10 to 15 seconds long. I think that's what I said. But let me know, I wanna set you up with one. Uh, plus I want it to be a onesie so I can wear it during cold weather. Ooh, I love that. So you don't like the dinosaur onesies you've seen, Snackers? If you love spicy gay mafia drama, then you'll love it. Okay, wait, what was it called? Can someone write me a note to check out Kin Porsche? I would love to. Good, I'm glad you're doing good, Cappy. I'm glad you're doing good. Is this too intense? gosh huh, did anyone uh, click on that go watch that <laughs> please that was great that's for sure your entrance cappy for sure that's amazing oh huh, my gosh i wasn't expecting that <laughs> amazing not too intense at all i think it's actually perfect for the brand of chaos we have over here <laughs> So good. You you were so quick with that too. <laughs> the second I asked, you were like this. <laughs> so good. Mm. So incredibly good. Had that locked and loaded, honestly. Honestly. I love it. They did an amazing job. Amazing, amazing. Yes, yes. Yes. Bear Mom. Bear Mom is here. Oh my goodness. Oh, you have a Grogu onesie, Amanda? That sounds amazing. Do, do, do. But also, yes, I also jumped on this one the minute. It dropped because I love same. That is so good. I can't wait. Uh, I'm probably not going to get it now just because I have so many patterns from them that I need to do anyways. 
and um you know money saving but i'm i'm getting it in the future i'm getting it it's a plan especially i want to make the the lollipop more than anything like the hood is cool but the lollipop it's fuzzy oh nice 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 oh another thing i'm super excited for um i want to get more onesies for stream stuff you know it is it's such a cute little addition I was away. Did you respond about the pic? I did. I said I was wondering uh, when I sent you back the pic of the deity if you would catch on that they had black hair and if you would question it. <laughs> that as an intro, if yes, then not only is it Cappy approved, it is Take also it Nathan pancakes. approved. It's a baby. baby. Uh, what would you like to name our child, Babbitt? Babbitt Jr. I don't know what that look was for. I'm sorry. <laughs> I also bought two hats this month. What, uh, which ones? Which ones? I don't like the way they look. The ones out now I have or I don't like. Aww, that's fair. That's fair. I hope you're able to find something that you like, though. That's terrible. I wish I could sew so I could make it happen for you. Ooh, enjoy your spaghetti, Trinky. I've got to run the fridge project beckons, but I'll be all over Discord and the streams. And as soon as I get my first paycheck for my job, yes, the jar of peach jam. Absolutely, absolutely, Nick. Please be safe on all your questing today. Um, and I hope you have the most good time with. I'm brain broken with your uh, your your moving of the fridges. I love you, Nick. Have a good day. <laughs> I'm telling you, my, my brain's just shut down. It's just over it. All it can think is house, 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 house. That's all it can think. Uh, I'm gonna start recycling previous ones. Ooh, that's a good idea. That's a good idea. Do, do, do. A link tight hat and a floppy witch hat. Ooh, uh, uh, where did you get them? Uh, oh my gosh. I, I feel like I know what hat you're talking about. I feel like I know, but I can't remember the person's uh, name. And they will never know. No, they won't. Tell your brain to stop thinking so loud I can hear it in mine. It, I just, it's just, it's so ho house focused. It's just house, 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 house 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 uh the second we're approved for the house you know if we do get that approval um i will definitely be letting you guys know because at that point i can't guarantee any schedules until i am moved <laughs> Uh, but I still want to try to stream here and there during the process as long as my pc is still set up or uh i can get it set up over at the other place pretty fast Yes, it is the same person, Rain. It's exactly the same person. I love them. They're amazing. We are mutuals. They uh, make amazing content. Uh, their hats are so good. And they're the ones who taught me how to put wire in the brim of my hats so that they didn't go all flappy flop. 10 out of 10 human being right there. 10 out of 10. Yeah, exactly, exactly. Don't want to overwork myself or stress myself out. The cool thing is, is we've gotten like a whole bunch of the packing done. Not all of it, but a whole bunch of it. So hopefully the moving process will go like a lot smoother than normal. We got to rent a U-Haul though, because we don't have a truck. Get all that sorted. The actual act of moving is the worst and I'm not looking forward to it um, but I'm ready for it to be over ready for it to be over huzzah yeah they're a great uh, great crochet artist 
the patterns they make are 10 out of 10. I think I own the floppy witch hat one. I don't think I've ever made it, but I own it. I'm so cut off. I need to stop buying patterns. I know, right? Could you imagine how quickly we could have it done with a, a whole group of the cult? The patterns they make are copy approved. <laughs> Um, I love that we could just wildly claim that anything is Cappy approved via that emote. <laughs> just pay us with pizza and beer. <laughs> oh, we still have a year-ish, but I'm dreading the process. Impatient for the end result, but OMG. No, exactly. So impatient to be done with it, but then I think about, like, all the work that's gonna come up, and I'm like, Ugh, can't I just already be moved and have the money to decorate? Come on, come on, come on, come on. Impatient, I don't know where that O came from. Oh, you're so good, no worries. No worries at all. I've noticed, especially as my patience has dwindled with um, just typing <laughs> in general, just getting less patient as the days go on. I type out some of the craziest shit and then just hit send. So many misspelled words, no capitals. It's truly, it's bad. <laughs> oh my goodness. That is my type of currency. Are you guys ready? I want to do all the cooking streams once I get moved. And all like the like decorate like cookie decorating, cake decorating. I have big plans. It's Entangled Fae. That is who it is. They're amazing. They're so good. Ten out of ten bean. Little baddie bean. I'll make taco chip cookies to help pay. <laughs> I love it. OMG, that is me. Oh wait, the 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 just typing out shit and hitting send. I gotta stop doing it. I gotta start like reading stuff. I'll send out messages and then just hit send and walk away. Come back later and realize like 50% of it was misspelled. No capitalization. Only emojis as as punctuation. Which I'm actually never gonna change that. No one can convince me otherwise. Emojis are the OP punctuation. Yes! Oh my gosh, yes, 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 Babbitt. It's gonna be so good. It's gonna be so good. Absolutely, Snaggers, do what you gotta do. Am I even on screen? Emojis is punctuation for the win. No one can know I'm, I mean, no one will think I'm mad at them if I just spend, send a heart or a smiley face at the end of every sentence. Yeah, they're gonna be so good. Babbitt, I'm so excited about that. I agree with you. The, the ear add-on set is going to be... I will buy those patterns. <laughs> no one can stop me, okay? I have an addiction to spending my own money on patterns that I'll probably never make. No. <laughs> Ever read the messages we send each other? They probably think we were typing in code. As long as we know what's happening, it's fine. Exactly. But see, that only works up until I start sending messages in other people's Twitch chats. Then it's bad. <laughs> that happens to me when I'm excited and respond to a topic. All the misspelled words. I love it. Just the pure excitement. Okay, Brain just pictured a sentence full of swears punctuated by a heart. Exactly. Exactly. <laughs> oh my goodness. Hey, I can't help you there. Yeah. Yeah. The, see, that's, that's the part where it becomes an issue. Outside of that, it's fine. I know you guys understand me when I just post random sentences that are highly misspelled. It's the other peeps where it becomes an issue, no? <laughs> I feel so bad. I go into like these other streamers that I like highly look up to and then I just type nonsense in their chat. 
Not willingly. It's always an accident, but you know. Do 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 do. The fact that it's only been an hour. What? I feel like we've been streaming for so long. We've talked about so many things. Do 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 do. Mm. Weird spammy text messages. Do 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 Love me a cardi. I need to make myself a cardigan again. I only made that one and then I sold it. <laughs> uh. Remake the same one nice again. To meet you. Bonjour. Hello, hello, hello. Thank you so much for the follow. If you'd like, you can tell us a little bit about yourself in chat. Um, but if you would rather just lurkies, that's totally cool. I am a huge lurker here on Twitch. We stand lurkers here. Yeah, so the first one I made was pastel stripe and black. Or no, it's called retro stripe. It's not called pastel stripe. Uh, which is, let me see, let me see, let me see, let me see. I know I have some skeins of it behind me. Oh, so I wanted to tell you guys, um, yesterday you guys did a whole bunch of subbies and it was super, super sweet of all of you. Um, I do not have all of my yarn out, so we can't work on the September scarf like we were planning. Um, but I will be contacting all of you who subbed yesterday to figure out what color you would like your row so that I can go in and do it once I move. Um, but also as an added bonus, cause y'all did six subbies yesterday. Um, I will eat a spicy bean later today. I'll do it. I'll do it. I'm going to eat lunch first, but then I'll do it. <laughs> mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, that was meant for rain. You're so good. No worries. Hello, Trixie. How's it going? How's it going? How's it going? I hope you're doing well today. I swear. Oh, I started playing uh, Starfield yesterday. Thank you, Trixie. Thank you so much. I was super nervous. I don't know why. I was super nervous that nobody would like it, um, which is so delusional of me. Um, so it's so nice to just hear all the kind words. You guys are so sweet. Welcome to the happiest, baddie, flappiest, crochet, crazy, spooptacular stream here on Twitch. Yeah! So I just started it. I have not gotten very far into it at all, Bran. Um, my initial read is that it's definitely not Skyrim in space. I don't know why anyone would have said that, like, from the get-go. Uh, it's definitely Fallout in space without the nuclear apocalypse, right? Um, I honestly really like it so far, but I, I'm obsessed with Fallout. So, for me, this reads as the type of RPG that I would definitely like. Um, I played on controller, so whatever, like, control issues I may have run into, I just pulled out my controller so I didn't have to deal with that. Um, I'd say that if you wanted to give it a shot, Bran, like a second shot, you should really, really hook up controller. <laughs> Um, if you haven't already. Yeah. No, it's... I was, like, I was a little confused and it felt like there was, like, a lot to process from keyboard. Um, the controller made it a thousand times easier. Ghosty! Ghosty, how are you doing? Angle bye. bye. Ghosty, how's it going today? Oop. 
whoop, whoop. It's a ghosty. <laughs> Um, but I really like it so far. The graphics are insane, Bran. Uh, everything looks so good. Um, I will say it feels less Bethesda in the way that there's like, there's, there's not like stuff everywhere that you can pick up. There's stuff, but not to the same extent. You know what I mean? There's not enough green. I want some green. Oh, on the planet? Yeah. See, but that first that that first area that you go into that's like city and also like all the swamp with the trees and like that was designed so well. It looks so pretty. But again, yeah. I I I really like Fallout. And Fallout like everything's destroyed. There's like no green. So, I guess for me it's not like a wild Thank you, Rue! You're so sweet! Just the first place. <laughs> yeah, I'm excited to see what else, like, what other planets are out there and to explore most of the stuff. Um, but yeah, I mean, if you were looking for, like, flora and fauna, that is the big, the big disappointment from the game. But uh, in my personal opinion, I don't see that as a deal breaker for myself. Yeah, they changed their name again. They're Brennipede now. I love it. Fits my bugginess more. Too many tacos? Oh my gosh, are you okay, ghosty? Are you all right? Do 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 do. I swear. It's going to take me forever to finish this. I don't even know. It's so, it's so many stitches now around. So, so many. They said tacos? I said yes. All. <laughs> I love it. My goodness. I hope... I hope you don't regret that decision later. <laughs> do, 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 do. Bam, bam, bam. Work on the square of the granny. Needs <laughs> is getting good at cooking for me, but girl can't portion for a tiny little frog. Oh no! <laughs> Lots of foods, huh? Lots and lots of foods. Pretty sure I will, but worth it. As long as it was worth it, I guess, you know? As long as at the end of it, it's worth it. Who can blame you, you know? Who can blame you? I'll cut my controller and cry again. And try, I said cry, what? <laughs> uh, but at the moment, I'm fully into Baldur's Gate 3. So fair, so fair. I don't know if I'm gonna end up getting back into Baldur's Gate 3. I want to. I think just, I don't know. For a game that I was so excited to be like D&D, it feels so restricting on what you're allowed to do. Just remember me for who I was. Oh my gosh. So much skeddies. Oh my gosh, I wanna make skeddy. I haven't had spaghetti in so long. To be fair though, it was my comfort food for a long time, so we really overate on the spaghetti. <laughs> Same thing happened with chicken salad. Now I'm officially over it. I will cry. <laughs> I want to get back into it. I for sure want to get back into it. I'm just like, ugh. Ooh. It's so difficult. Are we almost at the end? We're almost at the end of the round. Veil of the Void. Ooh, I like. I like, I like. I'll have to look into it. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm very, like, I don't know. I. Most RPGs can be like restricting in the sense that like they have a, a story you have to follow and all that good stuff, but still, but still. 
Oh no, gotcha. Just the dry cry slip up. I love it. <laughs> I use Google a lot to get us through. That's very fair. That's very, very fair. Um, honestly, I wish I would do that with more games instead of just giving up on them. I think I would just want to run a campaign like Boulder's Gate 3, and by run, I mean play and not DM. I don't want that responsibility. Yeah. I feel like if they made a game that lent to, like, customization, I don't know. I feel like they have games like that, don't they? Where you can pretty much, like, build a DD and d campaign, but, like, virtually. I guess that's more what I'm interested in. Just being able to play, like, a D&D &D campaign virtually with friends. And have, like, visuals to go with it. That's the problem that I have with D&D. I can't see things in my brain like everyone else do. Not everyone else, but a majority of people. Oh, it can totally be done. I bet it can. I've, I've never, like, super looked into it. That was kind of what I felt like Baldur's Gate was going to be. It was going to be more of, like, an open... You know? I feel like we're so restricted from the very get. You message me so we'll answer any questions. Heck yeah, Trinky, thank you. <laughs> I got a romance with Sassy Vamp at least once. By the way, by the way, over weekend, found a new desk for myself, trying to sort delivery, but should have it. Ooh, by the upcoming weekend? I want to see, Trixie. I want to see! Do you have, like, a picture of it you could share with us? Obviously not, like, the exact unit uh, until it gets delivered. Or, or you could wait until you get it delivered and show us it set up. Whatever, whatever you want to do. Y'all could have an adventure in Obsidia. <laughs> I love that. That would be amazing. Are you guys using any programs to set something up virtually? So much more craft space. I love that. I love that. I love that so much. Incredible. Incredible, incredible. Do, 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 do. Going to, I'm gonna try and build a virtual. Okay. Okay, okay. I have heard of the virtual, uh. Isn't there like a virtual tabletop program you can use? If not, I can get some maps. Heck yeah. Heck yeah, heck yeah. See, the only time we've played D&D, we played like two sessions. It, we didn't get very far at all. Um, and we had like nothing visual to go with it. And I felt like I was just struggling so hard to be on the same page with everybody the whole game. I didn't find out till like a year later that I they all were seeing stuff in later. their head and I wasn't. But it made a whole lot of sense after that. Welcome back, snackers. Virtual tabletop is the main one. You can make your own maps and import them. Ooh, that's dope. I love that. Heck yeah, heck yeah. I'd have to see it like in action, but that sounds dope. See, my thing too is like, I always want to get into a D&D &D campaign. And then I think about all the time I don't currently have. <laughs> If it was a one shot, not a campaign. I really want to play my goblin bard named Gur and embrace who he is. I love that. You should. You should, you should. Ah! Dropping stitches left and right. Oh my gosh. Use on the Star Strong Odyssey, like 3D models and a map and everything. Oh, cool. I haven't put I have I have put much thought into his backstory. Oh really? 
Heck yeah, that's so sweet of you, Wolverine. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Do, 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 do. My whole life is just double crochets now. I'm so over the day. All I want to do is when I get back from lunch, just call it a day. But I'm getting off an hour early today to fix my tire, so I can't complain much. Um, I'm so sorry about that. You got a flat tire or something? What's going on? Once the DM and specifically doing a mix of D&D &D and Veil so everyone can do what they know. Interesting. Interesting. I definitely have to check out Vale at some point. Okay, cool. I'm caught up on chat. Just checking, just checking. Could share a product picture if wanted. The one I'm getting is secondhand, but excellent condition. It's a discount, discontinue IKEA Gallant Corner Desk. I would love to see. I would love, love, love. That is amazing. New desk is always so exciting. I have the corner desk now, but I'm, I'm thinking I made a mistake with all the shelving that's on the top of it. I would really like like a flat desk <laughs> all the shelving has made it a little difficult in a couple of different ways um the shelving underneath is fine i think the like the the shelf that like my uh monitor is on is way too high up so i constantly find myself like with my head my like neck cricked up um and it really uh it, it held me into certain positions with camera and placement and stuff uh, not a flat, just a nail. Uh, I think it's like on the thickest part. Okay. Not like in the tire. It's been there since Saturday. Okay. All right. Cool, cool, cool. You can still get around. That's good. That is good to hear. Do, 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 do. At least for the moment. Um, but that's good that you're going to get it all taken care of. You got this. You got this. Editing the Chuck VOD, or am I enjoying the Chuck VOD? No one will ever know. The Chuck VOD? Am I missing something? Oh! <laughs> the fucking chicken! <laughs> I had completely forgotten about the fucking chicken costume. <laughs> oh my gosh, I forgot we named it Chuck. <laughs> I love that you're like, am I editing it? Or am I just watching it? <laughs> Amazing, amazing. I need to go in. I started editing the mail time VOD from like forever ago. I need to go in and finish doing that today, probably. Probably won't finish it today, but I'll try my best. I think I might be safe. Uh, ooh, but I'm going to the tire place to have confirmation. I had my mom call for an appointment and let them know I'm coming because I know what to say. But when it's time to speak, I forget what I called for. I feel that so much. Making phone calls is like pulling teeth. I feel like my best way to do is I'll like write out what I have to say before I get on the phone. It doesn't make the anxiety much better, but it helps me get all my points across. 
Would it be wrong of me to blame Justin Timberlake for the downpour of rain? I came home in considering the last song that played on the radio before it started was Cry Me a River. Uh, yeah, I'd say that's reasonable. Go ahead, blame Justin. <laughs> I love it. I love it, I love it. Hey, it's neat. Not like a system that is like a cross between Veil and d and I mean, I had figured out how to make standard D20 mechanics work in tandem with all the D6 systems of Veil, which has some similarities to GURPS, uh, but is simpler in most ways. Where different players are playing two different systems. Oh, that sounds very interesting. Should I blame TLC since Waterfalls came on before that? You know what? I think simultaneously you could blame both of them. You could say it was the power of them coming together that really did it. My notes was appointment nail tire. Oh no. Yeah, for my notes I've got to write down like, Hi, my name is so-and-so, and this is what I am calling for, and I gotta, like, write down all of my questions that I have, and... It takes, like, 30 minutes. It takes, like, 30 minutes to do anything. It's fine. It's fine. I'm an adult. It's fine. Do, 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 do. Oh my gosh, we're finally on to the next round. My goodness. My goodness. Um, could we get a poll going for our lunchtime game? I am already feeling hungry and I also kind of just like feel this need to get up and stretch my legs right now, you know? Mm-hmm. <laughs> so fair about it. So fair. I can get another pink skein. Ah! Oh my gosh! <laughs> I hit the space bar and I started playing a Cappy video again. Uh, I didn't want to leave because I want to save it. I'll bookmark it. I'll come back to it later. So many tabs open. Uh, the game poll is up, peeps! Go ahead and vote. If you would like to uh, pick what game we're playing today. Oh, I like that. Oh, that's gonna have so much room for crafts. Terexe. Terexe. That's honestly, the simplicity of it is perfect. It is perfect. I love that one side is like way longer than the other two. That is the main craft side. That is amazing. Oh, I'm so happy for you. New desk is such a good feeling. It's such a good feeling. Oh. Oh, I love that. Oh, that's so cool. Heck yeah. Well, extensions. We are tied. Gartic and words is currently tied. We can't have it. We can't have it. Do, do, do. It's a whole pep talk for me, too. <laughs> Aw, the struggle. Do, 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 do. I need a new desk, but need to find a spot first before getting a new one. The struggle. The struggle. I also like that Veil is easier to neatly write people in and out if you can't be available at all times. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, I love that. That is that is amazing, Trixie. That's gonna be so good. I'm so excited for you. You said it should be here. Uh... Oh, you said you said you were still working out tracking, right? That's exciting. Keep me updated, though. I'd love to know. I'd love to know when you get it. Uh, words is winning right now. I will go ahead and set up words. Although, 
It might not stay winning. Fingies crossed. Da 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 <laughs> I am a sleepy. Uh, someone locally is uh, sorting to deliver it for me, uh, which is lucky. Oh, as you can't fit it in your car. Oh, that's amazing, though. Oh, that's right. You're getting it secondhand. So they're just shipping it to you, right? That's amazing. One of my fave work pants shrunk again in the wash first time was to my ankle. And it was fine. Now they're above? What? That is so annoying, Snackers. I'm so sorry you're dealing with that. Okay, here. Here is our games. We are playing words. Oh my gosh, no, you're so good. You're so good. You're writing a whole campaign. That takes that takes brain power and effort. And of course you want to share it with everyone. Too late to change now. Oh no. Okay. All right. Here's your game. I'll be back 10 to 15 minutes. I'm just going to stretch, go use the restroom, make some food. I actually don't know what I'm eating. So that might take me a couple minutes extra. Um, but yeah, I'll be back. Okay. I'll see you guys very soon. Enjoy your game.
Alrighty, I am back. Do, do, do. Thank you, Trixie. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, gosh. I'm completely stuck on this one. <laughs> it was okay. It was good. I, uh, I, um, got to stretch my legs. I had a little snacky. I'm gonna wait until LG gets home to eat anything, like, big because my brain has said no to all the food in the house. Um, but that's okay. Michael got me. Do, 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 do. This one completely stumped me. I sat down, I couldn't think of one frickin' word. Thank you guys so much for playing and participating while I went and I took my little break and break. I super appreciate it. Let me go to BRB real quick so I can get the display cabinet set up over on Discord. And then we will, we'll jump into it. We'll see what you guys have been up to. Yeah, I bet it is. Thank you, thank you so much, Rain. Thank you, thank you. All right, let's get into it. Here we go. Hello. It's display cabinet time, Spectre. My goodness, get up, get up right now. Uh, so first things first, uh, the cat ear beanie from Rain. Oh, I like the, I like the colors you chose. Is it like a color changing skein or did you pick the colors? It's very cute. I like it. I like it a lot. You kicked ass. What pattern did you use for this? I really like it. It's nice. Oh, it is a color changer. Nice. Well, it worked out perfect. I love that just like the little tips of the ears seem to be that color. I like it like the gray. It looks nice. It looks nice. Ooh, I actually saw this on Instagram. Sad. I love. I love their little patchwork sweater. I remember when you first made the sweater. My whole heart. I also, I really like the crown that you added. Look at a little crown on their head. Oh, it's so cute. This is just precious. Kai looks amazing. I love it. I love all the stitching. Everything just looks so good. It's a granny stitch ear beanie. Oh, you found it on Raverly. Nice. I love it. Kai is looking amazing, Sad. You're killing it. I know the sweater. Well, do you remember when... You might not have been here. They the, When they originally posted the sweater, it was just the sweater. And on their Instagram, Sad was saying um, that they, they did the patches on the sweater to kind of fit in with, like, the, the cloth wig piece to kind of make them, like, a patchwork king. I love it. A 10 out of 10. Great idea. Wonderful aesthetic. I love it. Yes, yes, yes. It's so good. Little witch hat was meant to be big enough to fit my head, but I figured, but I'd forgotten where in the pattern I left off. Rather than frog and start over, I finished it off and decided to either have it for a headset decoration or add it to a headband. I love it. Babbit. It's so cute. I love it so much. I love the little tiny brim. It's amazing. 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. Yes, the headset. Exactly. I gotta get headset accessories. I love it. Oh my goodness. Beautiful. Beautiful little hat. Oh, you were talking about this. The Error Pez. 
Oh my gosh, that is so cool! You now have a very, very unique one! I love it. Everyone make all the headset stuff. Do it! <laughs> That is wild. That's so cool that you got one, though. I know that, like, those are, like, highly sought after by collectors, too. And I know you're collecting, or you have a little Pez collection. Oh, so that's so cool. I love it. He has decided the tub is a good place to snooze in while his dad is in the shower. That look. That look that they are giving. Oh, my gosh. Hey, they look comfy in that big old tub. <laughs> So uh, freaking cute. <laughs> Little baby. Little angel baby. Astro, hello, how's it going? Guys, can we get a shout out for Astro? How have you been? How have you been? What a cutie, right? Little baby. Little baby. Oh, have you heard anything about the school in uh Sweden, right? Right? Fingies crossed. Fingies crossed for good news. Also made this for my Pez collection. Snackers, it looks so good. I love it. Oh, that's amazing. I love the little doot too. That's so good. It's so good. Is it like a sign that do you have it like put up in front of your Pez collection? That is so cute. I love the iron bead work you've been doing lately. So good. Rue! I got a brand new monitor. It's my first one that I ever purchased and the second one I've had since I was a kid. My first one was an old CRT monitor. Oh my gosh. Look at that! It looks so fancy! It looks so fancy, Rue. Amazing! Amazing, amazing! Uh... We went on a big walkie today and he's basically been melting into all the furniture since we got home. Dude, I was so excited when I got it. I'm so happy for you. That is so exciting. I remember when I bought my first monitor, which is the one I'm on right now. And I was just like, ah, I was just so giddy, you know? It's so good. I also, I love your little setup. It's going, I'm working on some drawing right now, uh, but school-wise, my application got approved and moved to the pool to be selected for interview. <gasps> I'll know if I get the interview around the 1st of October. Finland, that's what it is. Okay, my bad. <laughs> that's so fucking exciting though. Oh my gosh, I love it. Ah, ah. It's so close too for you to hear back. Definitely, definitely keep us updated. If, if you don't, I'll come searching you out to find out. That's so exciting. Uh, I'm working on getting a new monitor, so hopefully I can send you guys another pic soon. Also, that's the cleanest my desk has ever been. Fair. <laughs> so fair. Honestly, the only reason why my desk is so clean lately is because I have packed away everything I own, pretty much. <laughs> I was AFK and heard Finland. Yes, um, the stay-at-home astronaut, who is an amazing streamer, by the way. You all should be following him. Um, they are looking to take some school, some, like, classes in Finland, which is so exciting. Um, and they just, their application got approved, so now they're moving on to, like, an interview portion of it. The excitement. I feel that so much. Yeah. Especially with all the crafts. Like, the desk, it just, it can't stay clean. It can't stay clean. Um, I think you just gotta space them. Yeah! I love that emote. It's one of my favorite emotes. Oh yeah, big walkies. <laughs> Wait a second. <laughs> Look at their face! <laughs> oh my gosh. A baby. It's a baby! <laughs> I think one of my favorite parts of display cabinet is like zooming in on all of your pets. <laughs> the melting boy. <laughs> I'm in a perpetual state of most of my stuff being packed because we move around a lot. That's very fair. That's very fair. I was about, yeah. I'm just packing for hopefully the one move. <laughs> They're baby. Uh, yes, I also just attended a festival here for the Finnish population in Minnesota. 
and it was so cool to try all the snacks and candy and meet folks and hear Finnish spoken in person. Uh, and now I'm picking up the language. I also found a place that does in-person Finnish language lessons here too. Wait, that sounds so perfect. I, I, I hate to jump a little forward in time, right? But to me, to me, it sounds like this is meant for you. Um, it just, it just feels like all the energies are connecting at the right time. You know, like the, the meetup and then you found the lessons. It feels like it's meant to be. Yes, like the stars are aligning. No, Astro. That's exactly how I feel about it. That's, that's exactly like the sense that I get. Do, 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 do. Oh, we got some ads. Ad time. So much excite though, so much excite. I will wait, I will wait to move forward on display cabinet until ads are over. I don't want no one to miss anything. <laughs> That's exactly how I've started to feel about this move too. Like it just feels like, it feels like things are aligning. It feels like everything's happening as it needs to so that we can do this and we can do it right. I'm so excited. So many good things. So many good things. I'm just gonna crochet for like two minutes while the ads go. Everyone has to look at the stinky boy till ads are over. Exactly, exactly. It's just giving the stinky boy more airtime, <laughs> which we all need, of course. <laughs> uh. Do, 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 do. Stay strong, ad viewers. We shall be waiting for your return. Honestly, ads feel like such a plague sometimes. I've been spoiled for too long. For the longest time, I was able to subscribe to all of my peeps that I love watching, um, but we've been trying to save money because of the move and everything lately, so I've had to stop being subbed to absolutely everyone that I love. Um, and uh, the Twitch ads are weird, yo. <laughs> Why are there so many weird ones? The more I worry about that line coming down from his nose to his lips. Wondering if that's normal or not. I think it's normal. I think it's very normal. Tacos were not a great idea. No. No, Ghosty. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. But hey, you said they were worth it. You know? You gotta eat them consequences just like you ate them tacos. I hate to run. Absolutely, oh my gosh, Trixie, do what you have to. Enjoy your dinner, I hope it's super good. And I hope to see you again very soon. Me, because of the rent increase. I hate that. I hate that. That makes me so angry. Why do they do that too? He's currently passed out on a pile of blankets on the couch pretending he's not spoiled. <laughs> Life is so hard over here for a puppy. Life is so difficult. Do, 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 do. He's making it look weird. <laughs> Little Dio baby. I heard, yes, like the stars are insert flea commercial about cats. <laughs> oh, you're back. Good, good, good. Okay. I was saying, yes. I feel that so much. Like, I, I. I feel that with this situation. Like it feels like the stars are definitely aligning and this is meant for you. Um, I so hope it is too. Like that's just incredible. You get to do the schooling that you want. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. I feel like that's been happening with me lately too. Like I'm most of the time I'm like overly anxious and nervous and like overthinking anything. And there's just like a constant pit in my stomach. But up until like two weeks ago with this move, it finally hit me. I was like, I don't know, just everything's settled. I just feel, I feel it, you know, like the stuff is happening. It, it's the stars have aligned. That is the perfect way to put it. Um, oh, that's amazing. Oh, heck yeah. Yes. Oh, good. Oh, good, good, good. I'm so glad too that you were able to get to Minnesota and like get everything settled. It's so, it's just... Ha, ah, you know, the breath of fresh air. 
Ooh, another remake, but an old favorite. I used to use Dan for more hard rock or metal type songs, but got where I use him for a lot of different songs now. Mad I didn't get his eyes to glow as red as I did in the try before, but it's not too bad. It's kind of a spoopy season video, but not a set one, uh, if that makes sense. No, so nothing too scary. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Let me know. That sounds good. Sorry guys, that was insanely loud. I was not prepared for that. Hopefully this is better. Let me know. Let me know. Better. There we go. <laughs> Ooh. Uh... The twitchy eye was cool. <laughs> Babbit, their eye bones are wandering too much. That is the most uncomfortable sentence I've ever heard, Babbit. <laughs> That was incredible, Ghosty! Oh my gosh, thank you so much for sharing! That one was so cinematic. It was so good. It was so good. Um, let me see, let me see, let me see. I'm just so used to moving because we did it so much as a kid that it doesn't even phase me anymore. Well, I'm glad that it doesn't phase you anymore. The eyes are wandering weirdly and Ghosty says fixing the eye bone should fix the issue. Okay. Everything in an M MMD model has bones. <laughs> yeah, but just the thought of like the sentence, his eye bones are wandering too much. <laughs> it immediately makes my skin crawl. <laughs> this was amazing though. Amazing, amazing. Ollie found this coat and honestly, I think it looks really good, especially if we can find some good boots to match. It'll be a lifesaver on rainy days. Also, it was five bucks, so there was no way we were leaving it. Oh my gosh, Ollie looks so handsome. I love it. That jacket does look good. With some nice boots, you're not wrong. I love the blue frames, like the, bru the blue glass frames. They look really good. They look so good on him. I love it. Love the jacket, right? Eye bones are connected to the brain bone. No. Ooh. I think I've seen this picture in action and it looks fucking amazing. For anyone who doesn't know, uh, Ghosty has ghosty streams i'm sure you know because you see the shout out come in every time every time ghosty's first chat pops up but um they have a little like png tuber a ghosty and it's fucking perfect and you guys should all go see it sometime i should just have ghosty fix them since he's got to do a more casual version of the model anyways oh valid valid just push it off on ghosty <laughs> Yes, it looks so good. It looks so good. I really, really like it. I really, really like it. Uh, matcha giving me a hand with my Hexy Cardi. Little matcha baby. Oh my goodness. They just look like the snuggliest little baby. Absolutely, Ghosty, absolutely. The snuggy baby. Oh, I forgot the music was paused. Here we go. There we go. <laughs> oh my goodness. Also, I love like the burnt orange color. Very fall. Very fall. I like it. Uh, the best little supervisor, honestly. So, uh, I got my tiny hands on bleach and purple dye. Also, Halloween edition makeup, but I'll try that later. 
Uh, featuring my baby trying to eat his apple half in the background. <laughs> oh goodness, that looks really pink in the sunlight. Oh, it's so pretty. Uh, I love it. I love it, Ollie. Little baby eating that apple. That looks amazing. It looks really good. Looks really, really good with like the curls too. Obsessed, obsessed. Uh, gotta divvy the work. Uh, my self model that Ghosty made is being picky about trying new clothes, which is hilariously accurate to me in real life. <laughs> I love that. <laughs> Such a good color, right? I bet it looks super good more purpley too outside of the sunlight. Cute little apple muncher. Uh, I couldn't stand it without some shading and went back in to fix it. And also added expressions. I love it. Oh, it looks so good. The shading, the shading does really pull it together. Oh, so good. So good. You've been killing it. You've been killing it. I was blessed by this bean. Look at the bean. <laughs> They're such a little baby. Their eyes are so freaking green. I love them. You did a puzzle! T, I love it. I love Ariel so much. And this is just the best scene ever because it's so ridiculous. Um, uh, The seagull songs. This is just so good. <laughs> oh my goodness. So warm today. Oh my gosh! I love your Grogu onesie, Amanda! Oh, it's so cute! That is amazing! You look so cute in it! I love it. I love it. It's the Babbit! And we've got a little Babbit wing going! I love it! Oh, what a tiny little baby! I love them. They're gonna look so good. They're gonna look so good, Babbit. I can't wait to see until the Babbit's done. Ooh! Oh, Halloween decorations! So cute. Beware! Go back! Oh, I can't wait to decorate for Halloween. I love the spider web you have coming down. Oh, that's so good. It looks so good, Amanda. Amazing. I love my onesie. You should. It looks incredible. I'm so excited. Once I have house, it's over. No. <laughs> I'm so warm. <laughs> Is it cold? Is it cold where you're at today? Ooh, that's pretty. I like that. Ooh, burps. 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 <gasps> Look at that one. He has a fancy butt. <gasps> and his little feet. He's a fancy burb. I get a whole bunch of onesies. It's cool out. Nice. Oh, you get to stay all nice and cozy. All nice and cozy, cozy. Ooh, a 90s throwback. Nice. Oh, it's a little mermaid horsey. I love it. <laughs> These are so cool. Thank you for sharing some pics with us from the fair. Tranky. Looks amazing. I like the fancy burb the most, I think. My bull, my hubby has a bull onesie. Oh, nice, nice. Uh, most recent make, pumpkin decor with coaster leaves. Pattern is free, oh, that is so sweet. This is so fucking cute. Oh, I love that, little pumpkin coasters. What a good idea. Those are adorable. I am actually obsessed. I'd say I'm gonna make them, but I know I'm lying. Mom, hello. I call we miss it you too. Six six. Sydney, 
Sydney, wait, I love the string you added to it. It looks incredible. Mom, how's work going today? How's it going? How's it going? Stream mommy! Absolutely no snaggers. This looks so good. It's perfect. It's perfect. Holy shit, you can just get like a view of the absolute insanity that is happening behind it. Snaggers, have you ever sent us a full picture of your Pez collection? I don't I don't think I've seen it. I could be wrong though, but I don't feel like I've seen it. Look at them. Look at the insanity. I love it. <laughs> There's so many. <laughs> Oh, Ma, we miss you so much. It has a tail and he wears it while on the road. Other truckers look at him weird when it gets cold, but he just looks at them and says, at least I'm warm. So fair. So many Pez, right? Yes, oh my gosh, I would love that. No worries if you can't right at the moment. No, no pressure or anything, but. An outfit I'm trying to get right on my self model. I didn't make the outfit. Don't have those skills yet. So fair, this outfit looks so intricate. Oh, it's so pretty though, Babbit. It's gonna look so good. Oh, I love that. I can't wait to see if you can get it to work out. Absolutely amazing. It's very pretty. It's very, very pretty. Okay, let me see. Okay, I'm gonna leave us here for a moment. Um, just in case Snackers finds a picture they would like to share with us. Um, that way I'm already here in the display cabinet. And I will take this time to grab more yarn. Oh, I had miscounted my rounds on this, like really bad. I thought I had like 17 more rounds to go or something like that. I only have 10. Woo, success. I got a light up spider web in that big window uh, that I got after I took the pictures and I got spider webs on the fencing. Ooh. Uh, resizing it appropriately is tricky. Oh, that makes sense. That makes sense. Yeah, 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 yeah. So hopefully we'll be done with it faster than I think we will. Also, hopefully because I'm out of pink yarn. Um, not entirely. I think I have one skein left. Possibly. Yeah. I might have more packed away too, but I don't think I do. I think this is all of it. But hey, at least for um, stash bust September, I did manage to bust through a piece of my stash. That's something. I'm going home to clean out my car and work on my window blanket. Ooh, you should send us an update with your window banky whenever you get a chance. Whenever you get a chance so we can view it next time. Yes, please do. I would love to see. Heck yeah, heck yeah, Amanda. This is why the bandana for the Dan model is wonky as fuck. Resizing it, my forte. Hey, that's totally fair. MMDs in general sound like a lot of big brain stuff, you know? Do I have a lighter nearby? I don't think I do. No, I don't. Okay. I will send it update. Oh, yeah, yeah, I read that. Uh, I think it's super cool that anyone can do MMDs at all. Really, right? Exactly. I also totally just remembered that I said I would eat a bean for you guys. Are you ready? Are you guys ready for the bean? This is for all the, uh, the subbies you got yesterday. Probably for the rest of until I'm done with this. I don't know. I haven't decided what I'm gonna do with the beans fully yet. Cause S September is almost over and I wasn't able to be here for most of it. Um, which is unfortunate, but life. All right, are we ready? Oh, do we wanna do a prediction? Do we wanna? 
I crave. Oh, you're craving dumplings. I wish I could get them to you. It's gonna be good. Fingies crossed. Uh, oh my gosh. This is wild. Holy shit. Oh my goodness. Oh, look at all the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle ones. All oh, the spoopy ones. Oh my goodness. Snackers. <laughs> I have so much more in bins. This is insane. What would the prediction be? Um, so we would predict whether it's going to be spicy or no spicy, I think. Would be... Oh, wait. They're all spicy. JK. Um, oh, that's a good question. We ran into this one last time, huh? Well, why don't we see... Why don't we do a vote on if it'll be the Carolina Reaper or the Habanero? Or one of the other three. Does that make sense? Because those are the two spiciest. I don't know. Maybe we won't do a prediction. What are our thoughts? What would you say is your weirdest or most unusual Pez dispenser? That is a question, Snackers. Extra spicy or not extra spicy? Yeah, that's what I was thinking. I guess we could do a prediction on if... Cause there's only five levels of spice and the last two are habanero and the carolina reaper mm. spiciest beans versus other beans yes yeah mm -hmm. i think that's a good way to do it i really just want to give you guys a chance to win a bunch of channel points that you can play with all oh, the princesses I love how you have multiple versions of most of the princesses. Oh my gosh. The Garfields. The Simpsons! I love that. Animal Crossing. Holy shit. This is insane. I don't own it, but I have seen it. It would be a giant Barbie with hair. Oh my gosh. The KK slider, right? Yes. Poll is up peeps or the prediction is up. Um, where is it? Here it is. There are five levels of spice. The prediction is guessing if it's gonna be one of the last two or one of the first three. The extra spicy, the not so spicy, if that makes sense. May Chibi never try to get me and my fiance to do a Simpsons family cosplay Halloween. Oh gosh. Do they like the Simpsons? Do you think it would be something Chibi would come up with? I wanna see this giant Barbie Pez now. Oh my gosh. I'm just looking at all the Pez still. I'm like, what the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck? There's almost no points going in on Not So Spicy. So if you put your points in and that one wins, you can win an insane amount of points from the 41,000 points that were put on the other one. <laughs> but it's almost over. <laughs> Oh yes, Mossy, do what you gotta do. Have a good have a good lurky lurk. There's so many. There's so many. It's incredible. It's in the Pokemans! Okay. Not so spicy. Okay. Let's do, let's do, let's figure out who gets what. Uh craft screen. She's been choosing easily family costumes. For cosplays in Halloween, I'd prefer never The Simpsons because we already have friends saying my fiance and I are essentially Homer and Mars. Oh, oh no. <laughs> All right, we ready? One, two, three. Ah, Cayenne, it was not so spicy. So whoever voted for the not so spicy, you won. You did it. 
Yes! Let me know how many points you get. Uh, the cayenne ones aren't too bad. They definitely, it feels like you swallow like a spoonful of cayenne, which is actually, it sounds pretty bad when I say it out loud. Um, is it gonna tell me who got what points? I wanna know. See details. Yeah, you guys got the 49,000 split. Incredible. Wait, you got 42,000? That's insane. I got 64? What? <laughs> the insanity. Wow. Wow. How much did you put in versus brand? I'm just curious. I want to know why it chose such drastically different numbers. Yeah. It, it, it helps us... Uh... It's, uh, it doesn't help us. It, uh, it shows the, uh, 10. <laughs> that makes sense. Oh, you put in 7.7 thousand. That makes sense. That's why it was so different. You're still saving up for VIP. Oh, yes, yes, yes. But I have 180,000, so no biggie. <laughs> All right. We've got our cayenne bean. We've got the bean. Let's do it. <laughs> Blech. Oh my gosh. The spice. <laughs> oh my goodness. I'm still saving for VIP. The beans will help. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I don't remember it being that bad. So trying to figure out. No, oh, <laughs> 40,000 points, yeah. Mom dumps them in. <laughs> oh my goodness. The gross. The grossness. It's not so much gross as it's just like abrasive, you know? <laughs> the worst part about the cayenne one is it literally feels dry in your mouth. Like it feels like you just like swallowed a spoonful of cayenne. Now it's in my teeth, so it's never gonna leave, you know? Thank you guys so much for all the subbies yesterday. I super, super appreciate it. Um, oh my goodness. Tongue, tongue is spicy. I wanna go back to the Discord page real quick and continue looking at these, honestly, cause I'm a little obsessed with Snackers collection. Oh my gosh, you have Easter and Valentine's Day ones. Oh my gosh, that bean. <laughs> Thanks for the points, Ma. <laughs> oh my goodness. I love it. They did. They just went directly from Ma to Bran, pretty much. So many themed ones. Oh wait, are they back there and I just don't see? Oh, I see them now. The little pumpkin and the ghost. Oh, this little ghost. Wait, I'm obsessed. Christmas is behind Halloween. Okay, okay, okay. That makes sense. Um. <laughs> My tongue. Okay, let's get back to crafting. Let's jump back into it. It's fine. I'm surviving. Oh my goodness. <laughs> At least it wasn't the Carolina Reaper. It's so impressive, right? I, I'm i just absolutely mystified at the amount of Pez you own. And I love it. Boop. Boop. There we go. Chat is in front of me again. Oh my goodness. Maybe 15 plus years. Oh my goodness, that's a long time. Oh, Astro, thank you so much for asking. I'm actually super, super excited about this. Um, a mutual of mine on TikTok, Confused Alice, A-L-Y, 
CE is pattern testing right now for a spider web poncho. And I got chose to do the pattern test and I'm so excited. Uh, we have like 10 more rounds to go. Let me see if I can stand up. Oh, 10 more rounds to go. And then I have to go do surface stitching all the way down the side, uh, the corners with the black to make like that webbing effect. And then like there's a large cowl, like a uh, neck piece, not so much cowl, I guess, but like neck piece um, that we're gonna make after that. Yes, yes. I'm so excited about this project. A, I'm just giddy that I got chosen to pattern test, like to begin with. <laughs> um, but this is such a cool project in general. It's based off of a cartoon character. Although I'm gonna be so honest, I don't know which one. Uh, I don't know the name. I don't know their name. Yes, there we go. Confused Alice. There they are. They're amazing. Please go give them a follow if you have a TikTok. They. Uh, are such a sweet bean, such an amazing creator. They're the only person I've ever pattern tested for. Um, and they're just so sweet during the whole process, every time. I love them so much. Uh, I can't stop or I'll get behind. Oh no. Oh no. A real addiction of Pez. See, that's my fear with the collection is that I'll get super into it and it'll be great. And then I'll fall off of it and then Years later, I'll want to do it again, and I'll be super behind. Too indecisive. <laughs> Thank you, though. I'm super excited, Astro. I am just over the moon excited about this one. It's such a pretty pattern. Oh my gosh, I feel like I'm going to have the sniffles now. Because of the spicy bean. <laughs> Oh, finally settling in, catching up on a much needed rest. That is amazing. Honestly, sometimes just taking a little bit to just catch up on some like self care and rest can make such a world of difference, especially for not especially like it works for it. It obviously is important for everybody, but um, content creators or like small business owners or people who run the whole show by themselves you know you have so much passion for the thing that you do so you just push forward 24 7 um until it's really caught up with you i'm about halfway done with my first hexi cardi i'm gonna make mushroom pockets i love that so much i was saying earlier um I was saying earlier, uh, the color you chose for your Hexicardi is so fall and I love it so much. It's beautiful. That like burnt orange kind of amazing. Uh, for wearables, are you still doing yarn under? Okay. So here's the thing <laughs> that I have to admit. My brain cannot comprehend yarn under for anything above a single crochet. <laughs> I can't do it. I don't know why. I don't know why it feels so impossible. Every time I've tried to do it, my brain just gives up so quickly, so quickly. So I think we're still doing yarn over, question mark. Oh no, was that yarn under? Bran, I don't know. <laughs> I don't actually know. It's my favorite color ever. Thank you, Bran. I can't wait to show it off when it's done. Oh my gosh, you should. A little BB one. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. Yeah, I have no idea. I have no idea. See, to me, that felt like yarn under. That's yarn over. I'm definitely yarn overing. I think. I have no idea. Uh, I'm surprised I learned how to yarn under for single crochet. Past that, I won't expect much else from myself. This is one of my favorite songs, I swear. All the, all the Kirby noises are just the best. The best. I'm yarn over for wearables as well because speed. Yeah, that's another thing is like, 
I've gotten really fast at doing single crochet yarn under or like decently fast, probably not as fast as I was for yarn over, but I feel like I would just struggle so hard, so hard at the speed for like the half doubles or the doubles when it comes to yarn under. I'm so excited to get home after work. A friend used to make fighting games based on our RP characters and recently told me he still had one of the ones I never got the chance to get and has sent it to me. I can't wait to download and try it out, even though it's at least a 10 year old, <laughs> you know? Oh my gosh, that is so exciting. Wait, that's amazing. That's so cool of them to go through and make those little little fighting games with your RP characters. That is so cool. What a thing to look forward to for the day. The cayenne is finally starting to leave my mouth a little bit. Just a little bit. He was so talented at it and made several. I love that. That is incredible. If you want, feel free to share some like, you know, video or screen caps of the game later if you want to just show off, you know, the work that they put into it. Tinker Auto made one once, but it was never anything as good as his. Aww, that's so exciting though. What, a, what an exciting thing to look forward to. That just makes me so giddy. I like, ah, just thinking about all the giddies. I grab some screen caps as I get my, yes, please do. I would love to see, that's so cool. The people who just sit down and just be making video games. So, so fucking cool. Just constantly, constantly look up to those kinds of people. I hate back post, front post. It looks good, but it's hell to do. Want to make a game so bad, but I do not have the brain cell needed. Well, if you ever want to learn, um, can we get a shout out for Captain, please, for Cappy? Uh, I have this wonderful, amazing friend here on uh, Twitch, who they also stream. Um, their name is the the Captain Coder. And um, I always forget these, so I had to think about it for a second. There we go. Um, they code on stream all the time. They also, um, they just love answering questions for peeps. And if you're ever interested too, they've actually been teaching me how to do some coding. Um, and we jumped into Unity yesterday. If you wanna check out any of those VODs, it might give you a little bit of an insight on like dipping your toes in. Um, I'm so super grateful for the for the effort and energy Cappy has given us to teach us some things. I'm super, super grateful for that. Yeah, yeah, so if you're ever interested, go ahead and check them out. They also do sell private lessons. Um, or like you can you can do group lessons as well. I have some unity assets and a million books on it, but I had empty. I don't even blame you. It's so much when you first walk into it. It's one of those things. Um, where I feel like unless it's like one of like your main focuses, it's really hard to move forward in it. Or like, unless you have someone to like explain, teach. But yeah, 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 yeah. We were working on a text adventure at first. I didn't get super, super far into it, but I learned some basic stuffs that I'm pretty proud about. And then um, uh, we just worked on making like a little paper doll character creator uh, yesterday in Unity, which was so cool. Do do. This is their website. Yes, they have some resources. Absolutely. Yeah, Cappy's so great at just like sharing knowledge. I'm very tempted to jump on that trans to code monkey pipeline. <laughs> Oh my goodness, I love it. 
See, I got so stuck when we were we were writing a text adventure, and I feel like the only reason I got stuck is because like I am not a writer. You know, like <laughs> I'm for as far as like creative ideas go, I feel like I'm a very visual person, but when it comes to my words, I will stumble, fumble, fall all over the place. Do 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 do. Ma, are you stopping home or are you just doing a bank run? Do, 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 do. I just blocked my third stack of granny squares and I think I'm gonna hop off so I can relax before work. Absolutely, Nathan. Please, please, please get some relaxing in. Get some chilling going. Uh, and enjoy work later. Please be safe whenever you leave too. I love you too, Nathan. <laughs> that goes out for chat too. Oh my goodness, you guys are all so amazing. I missed streaming so much. Ooh, so sometime very soon, hopefully, I want to start doing, like, Friday, like, indie games. I still want to primarily focus on crafting, like, crocheting and, and many of the other crafts that I used to jump into. Um, but I think I want to have, like, not Fridays, Thursdays, because Fridays we don't stream anymore, but Thursdays specifically, um... Yeah, maybe we'll do Thursdays. I think that's a good day. I have so many little indie games I wanna, I wanna play and I wanna show you guys. So many things. Bank run right now. Okay, gotcha, gotcha. Do 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 do. Na, 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 na. Love how I just found a pattern that included pizza-shaped earrings just as Nathan's leaving. Oh no! That's adorable, though. Pizza-shaped earrings. Yeah! Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think it'd be fun. I want to start making more, you like, edited down YouTube videos, too, and I feel like that would be very easy to do with some, uh, some shorter indie games. Keep it simple, you know? Because I know we dropped that edited video on the, the YouTube and then just never posted anything else. But editing is hard like really hard you know it's a whole lot of work uh, <laughs> Andrew hello how's it going how's it going how's it going ever played mad father I haven't if it's a scary I haven't for sure -sies. I thought I noticed you changed your hair yesterday but wasn't sure because of the hat yeah I dyed it I um right after I was getting over the COVID sickies I, uh, I was thinking, you know what? I felt like butt for a whole week. I want to feel good about myself. Uh, so we dyed it black and I really, really like it. I'm honestly super uh, looking forward to this era of hair <laughs> because um, bleaching my hair, oh, it was fun. I really love the colors, but my hair is so dead. It, it needs so much love. Scary me play something scary? Never. <laughs> It's not too bad, like pixel art. Oh, okay, that's not bad. Nintendo has an entire indie section now. Yes, it's amazing. I love their indie section. I have so many games from their indie section. Honestly, that's usually where I go and I find all my stuff, Sean Dyer. For Nintendo, at least. Thank you. You're so sweet. You're so sweet, Andrew. I love it because they do run some like hella sales on the indie games for the Switch too. I probably won't do any games from the Switch just because the quality looks so bad on stream in comparison to PC games, but... I don't know. I might not. They're... 
If there's some that I can only find on there, then we'll probably use the Switch. I was honestly, before I got a PC, I was so obsessed with my Switch. It was like the only thing I played games on. Capturing stuff from my Switch always looks a bit, eh, yeah, yeah, that's kind of where I'm at. Not to mention the capture card wants to be a butthead 99% of the time and just not work. But yeah, I think it was when I played, we had been playing Cult of the Lamb on my Switch for like the longest time. Um, and uh, we started over and we moved over to the PC version for the Twitch integration. And the first time I opened it up, I was like, holy shit, this game actually looks really good. Like the graphics are, are really nice. Everything looks crisp and clean. Like I was mystified at the difference between the Switch uh, art and the PC gameplay. It was, it was really different. And ever since then, I've been like, if I can get it on my PC, there's no way I'm getting it on my Switch. Well, the new Mortal Kombat looks like PS2 graphics, while the ones for the other consoles and PC look amazing. Wait, really? How do you mess up that bad that it looks that that shitty for a brand new game? Yeah, so it just kind of run its course for me. Like I barely ever use it. Same. Same. And it sucks because I there was a point where like my, my switch was my everything. Um yeah. The only reason I get on there now is to play Nintendo specific games. And at that point, I'm wondering, like, would I go forward and buy the next Nintendo console to come out if I know I'm probably going to find myself just using it for Nintendo games? I don't know. I use it for Mario Kart with M uh, when a new Nintendo... Yeah, when a... Exactly. Exactly. Gotta have it for the Nintendo games. Although I will say for, I was telling myself for the longest time I was gonna play the new Pokemon and I just never got around to it. Mm. Nah, nah. Doo, 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 doo. I like the Switch for like convenience. If I wanna like lay in bed and play a game. Yeah, to switch good then. But I'm also just too lazy to like actually hook up my PlayStation to any TV. <laughs> Gotta have that portable switch. Uh, I was a bit silly and bought a lot of games I have on PC and Xbox on the switch just so I could take games with me. Saints Row everywhere. Hey, that's amazing though. That's, that is, I will say, I will say my convenience kind of lacks from it because I spend like all of my time inside of my house. If I wanted to do more gaming on the go, that's why I bought the Switch originally was because I wanted to be able to uh, take it to work with me uh, and like play on my breaks or whatever. I wish the Steam Deck was more affordable because I would buy it in a heartbeat. Oh, same, 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 same. I was watching someone's video the other day where they were talking about how they have their Steam Deck set up with like extra memory and like all this cool stuff. And I uh, watching it, I was like, oh, I could do that, you know? <laughs> Gosh, I don't need to, but I could. Yes, exactly. That's the thing. Final Fantasy anywhere? done i'm sold no i'm really not i'm waiting on the steam deck to be a bit more affordable as well the second it is it's it's the game changer you know what i mean to be able to take your steam games wild do 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 
I can still get on, but not as much. We miss you on Final Fantasy, Ghosty. We haven't been on a whole lot. Well, I haven't been on a whole lot lately because all my brain can think about is moving. I miss you. I don't live there anymore. I hate that. We gotta get a ghosty back. Right? Having Final Fantasy on the go. I love it. Do 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 do. I just realized. Oh, something happened. <laughs> I just realized I haven't had my timer on like this whole time I've been crocheting. Boo. Boo. 6.5 comes out on the third and I will not be getting the fat cat parasol. No. No. Do you wanna, do you wanna go grind for it? I have been very anti Final Fantasy lately just because I like my brain is doing everything. But if you want to grind for that fat cat parasol, we'll do it today. Because I'm kind of the same way. I'm like, oh, sadness. I feel bad I don't have all the wolves. No. Uh, I want to actually finish making my Animal Crossing Island look nice, but I am in far too deep with Red Dead roleplay servers and Dead by Daylight. I love that. Wait, you've been playing Red Dead roleplay? Has this been on Strem? I haven't been able to get any more of the wolves either. I got the dragon and a moogle and a wolf. I also want to bard it up. There's too many things. That's so fair. That's so fair. I know I want a bard so bad. I want a bard so bad. I know, that's my thing too. Anytime I want to get on to Final Fantasy, there's just so many things I want to do. I want to be a bard, but I also want to do the events. But we also have story to get through, and I need to level up my crafting. Gosh, there's so many things things. Didn't y'all get the bard soul gem already? I don't think we did. I don't think so. But I could be wrong. So far my Red Dead roleplay has been my treat off stream so fair. And I've been recording for potential YouTube content but I want to bring it to stream. Uh, I just am still so new to role playing that I don't find a ton of scenes to pick up right now. Oh no, that's so fair. That's so, so fair. I also love that, that that's kind of like your thing for you right now. I've been doing that with some video games lately and it just, it feels nice to be able to enjoy something before bringing it to stream, you know? Like the first time reactions are always great, but just to get comfortable with something. I like that. Um... We gotta be ready for Battle of the Bands next year. I used to watch a lot of people do GTA roleplay and Red Dead roleplay. And, um, I don't know, I'm just so obsessed. I was like super into the no pixel GTA roleplays for the longest time. I drunk tanked for Anzai and Zara and a rando Saturday night, and I feel so bad for the rando. Anzai kept running ahead and getting killed, then I died, then Zara would revive, then die. And we made it through. Wait, you made it through? That's dope, though. At least you made it. I'm glad you are feeling better and happy you are back. Oh, I'm glad you're- I'm glad to be back. And I'm glad to see you, Andrew. I have been trying to let everybody know, um, because tomorrow we get to go look at the house again. And then the day after that, we get to apply for the house. So, if we get approved... I'm going to have to to be off of my stream schedule again, simply so I can pack up the PC and get it moved over and move the rest of the house. Um, I still want to try and like show up during that time if I'm able to, but it could be up to like two weeks, two to three weeks of like weird stream times, weird stream schedules. 
Then step three is pizza party! Celebrating getting the new house. Yes, exactly. Exactly. I'm hoping I can have everything 100% settled before Halloween so we can have one dope Halloween event. Um, and then we can like start moving into a normal, you know? I think I'll be ready before before Halloween though. We've just gotta just gotta get the new place shut up. I'll apply, I apologize to the rando profusely. Uh, Anne's eye kept giving me bad directions and Zara'd be like, stop listening to him. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> oh yeah, you're so sweet, Andrew. I think it'll be nice. I want to do a costume contest and I want to come up with other Halloween-y things that we can do virtually. I'll probably have a portion of it be on stream and then a portion on Discord. Just because I prefer doing community events on Discord or like community games and stuff through Discord. Unless they have Twitch integration and need to be done through Twitch. Um, I just don't want another Fall Guys situation from the subathon. I just don't want to deal with assholes on fun community days. It is ad time. I love when the ad button actually pops up and lets me know. <laughs> Cause it does it most of the time. Ooh, how many squares did you get done, Rain? It didn't for you? Oh no. I played Jackbox as an audience member in Amasis the other day and it was so much fun. Really? Really, really, really? Um, one. That's fair. That's so fair. Um, I still haven't played any Jackbox at any point. I need to do it. I need to just go in on Twitch and play with a bunch of randos to figure it out. Mine said ad starts in three. Twitch, what you doing? Oh, mine does say it starts in three. I'm not used to getting the starting soon ones. I'm used to only getting when they're live. Do, 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 do. All my brain can do is front post, back post, crochet now. <laughs> and I can't even do that right! <laughs> Hope you don't want to play with randos. I might be able to set something up with some peeps. Uh, yeah, yeah, absolutely. Absolutely, absolutely. Yeah, I just want to get a feel for like how the game works. Because I've never wanted to play any of them um, on stream or in Discord just because I've never played them. So I have no idea how to run it. I have no idea. I have no idea. Oh, the murder trivia. I was watching that happen very vaguely. I wasn't paying that much attention. I should have been paying more attention. I'll have to look into that. Maybe I'll go watch Atmos' VOD. To go see oh by the way can we get a shout out for atmos just because i think i've <laughs> i've talked about him so many times during today's stream atmos is an amazing queer streamer from canada um very much cozy chaos vibes everyone in their chat is so sweet and so so amazing to each other um but the chaos is real the chaos and the shrek mat shrek masks and everything is real Atmos is amazing. Atmos is amazing. We will have to get another uh, shout out through because do not follow that one. I don't know who that person is. There we go. There's a little one. Perfect. 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 Amazing. Do 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 do. Heck yes. If Atmos is live. And I'm not live. 
I'm usually in there. <laughs> so, I did what we call them brain bored. <laughs> Fun fact, I met my partner from Finland because of an Atmos raid. Really? That's really fucking cute. I love that. I love that so much. Atmos, just bringing peeps together. That is so fucking cute. What a story, too. I have been whisked away to Adland. Oh, the Adland. Do, 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 do. Ah! I'm probably gonna pack up the alchemy shop bookend thing here pretty soon. Um, Cause I don't think we're gonna work on it before we end up moving. But whenever we move, whenever it actually happens and we're set up, I'm finishing that fucking bookend. It is happening. It's gonna be my number one goal. Yes, there's a big one. Do 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 do. Oh, what you doing, Pooter? What you doing? Okay, we're back. We're back. Did anything goofy happen streamwise for you guys? One of my screens just went black for no reason. It's back now, though. It's being all goofy. Not for me? Okay, cool. Sweet. Sweet. Do, 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 do. Cool. Okay, it must have just been a me issue then. As long as no one was seeing it, then we're good. We're good. <laughs> it does that, you know? <laughs> It actually does that quite a lot. I think it likes to mess with me. It likes to watch the panic in my face. One of my monitors does that sometimes. I don't know why. So weird, huh? Just randomly goes dark on you. It's like, JK, I'm gonna take a nap. See you in a little bit. Do, 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 do. Exactly, it was just power napping real quick. Oh, I don't think I have actually, Bran. That's a great question. You had me download something that um, will tell me if I do it, right? It was like experience something. I just want to see if one. GeForce experience. I want to see if any are available. Blah, 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 blah. I do, I do have an update. Okay, well, whenever I get off, I'll go ahead and I'll run that through. Heck yeah. Thank you. <laughs> I didn't even think about that. Yes, oh my gosh. With a slight hankering to spend money. <laughs> what ad did you get? <laughs> oh no. <laughs> I check my drivers every week because I'm paranoid. You know, before you had me download the thing, I didn't even really think about it very often at all. <laughs> uh, oh, there was a pizza ad. Now I want pizza. I don't blame you. I would want to spend my money too. <laughs> oh, but I was saying, that is amazing that you met your partner through an Atmos raid. If that's not a fucking fairy tale, I don't know what is, you know? You know? Getting to meet your partner through a raid of your favorite streamer? Sounds too magical to be real. I love that though, that's so fucking cute. Do, 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 do. I love this poncho, but I'm over it. I love it, but I'm over it. 
I'm very over it. I told Atmos, and it went straight to his head. I love it. <laughs> oh my goodness. Do, 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 do. What? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Okay, I think my brain is borked. I keep dropping stitches. Uh, how far did we get? <laughs> we got halfway through this round. <laughs> Woo, we did a round and a half today. <laughs> Fucking killing it. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, get set up to raid out. Let's go find somewhere we can send all of the sweet cozy vibes over to. Uh, let me see. Let me see what besties I have on today. Uh... Yeehaw! <laughs> Amazing. <laughs> all right. Ooh, where's my list? All oh, my list of the peeps I wanna go check in on. Do, 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 do. Yes, thank you for being here. All the progress, right? All the progress. Well, I do always say, crocheting takes me twice as long when I'm on stream because I'm answering chats. Um, and that actually maths out perfectly for how far we got. Uh, boop -a -doop -a -doop. Where are all the peeps? Let me see, let me see. We will not be back tomorrow because it is Tuesday and I am off, but um, we will be back on Wednesday for some co-working. Also tomorrow I'm going to go look at the house so like fingies crossed that everything goes well and everything works nice and that we can put in an application very very soon because I'm so fucking excited. Okay. Do, 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 do. You know who I haven't seen in the longest time? I'm gonna have to go check up on them. I haven't seen Isa. Um, but we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna raid into the Diet Elf. If you do not know, they are an amazing streamer. I absolutely love them. They're actually playing Minecraft right now. Um, so yeah, 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 yeah. Go ahead and join me in following over and sending some love to the Diet Elf. Do, 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 do. Oh my goodness. Sorry, one second. I think there's someone at my door. So many things are happening. Okay, here is the Discord slash socials. Here is a uh, follower and tier one rave chance. Um, boop -a -doop -a -doop. I hope you guys have an amazing day. Be safe. Do something that you love. Um, yeah, and I'll see you guys again on Wednesday, okay? Okay. Bye!